Cassandra, welcome to the newest of the Marcos estates. I wasn't expecting company, but one must always be prepared. I can't believe you're here. Believe it, my friend. I'm not a man of one city, but of all cities. Who am I to deny the rest of the Greek world what I have to offer? Been here long? Long enough to establish myself as the foremost wine cellar in Kos. Well, the one wine cellar in Kos. The koans will come around eventually. What brings you to Kos, of all places? I've learned a thing or two about soil. Turns out Kefalonia wasn't the best place for grapes. Plus, the locals here love wine. Everybody loves wine. Besides, how profitable could I have been in a town of thieves and mercenaries? Not very. You made it a long way from home. I could say the same to you. Did you find what you were looking for? I did. I found my mother. What a coincidence! I found my mama too! Here, in Kos? Since Kos is her home, Kos is my home too! Say hello, mama! Your mama? You told me your mother was dead. Right, this is my adopted mama. We've become so close, she wouldn't have it any other way. Come on, Marcos. The truth. <laughs> well, mama is the owner of the vineyard. When her husband met his untimely death, it was going to be auctioned off. Something had to be done. So you stepped in to help. <laughs> how generous. It's ridiculous a wonderful lady such as mama cannot inherit her own property. Now we run the vineyard together. Isn't that right, Mama? She'd put up a fuss if she disagreed. It's her land, but she shares it with her precious son, me! Don't think I've forgotten that Marcos always has a plan. Sounds like one of your schemes. Cassandra, that was the old Marcos. These days, I live a peaceful life. You were tied up in a fort. That's peaceful? Uh, about that. I have a bit of a problem on my hands. Why am I not surprised? But it's something I know you could help me with, my friend. I know your credentials. Go on. You know me. I borrow some drag me, and before I know it, they're calling me the Khan of course. All thanks to the Cerberus, whom I owe the most. The Cerberus? First the Cyclops, now this? Don't tell me it's a three-headed dog. Don't be ridiculous. This is nothing like the Cyclops. This time I wish to make a peace offering, with nothing less than my finest wine. Finest? Palatable, maybe. Cassandra, you're like family to me. And since I'm family to you, I'm sure you wouldn't mind helping. <sighs> you're sure, are you? I promise I can afford to pay you this time. Just take my wine to the Cerberus. Simple. Fine. For all time's sake. I can always count on you! And the Cerberus can count on a nice wine pairing with dinner. Take it to his house! The Cerberus better not bite me. 